Hey, good morning, Scott. I hope y'all are staying nice and warm in that nice, cozy studio. It's really cold this morning, and as April mentioned, tomorrow expected to be even colder. First alert weather day, and of course, with the threat of a potential freeze, there's a lot of things to keep in mind, specifically when you're home when it comes to pipes. Now, I'm joined with James, the Aussie plumber, to sort of give us sort of what do we need to keep in mind when we hear freeze do we need to start taking action today before that? Uh, I would always um, recommend just taking action. Um, the biggest thing to do is just protect your pipes. Uh, a lot of our pipes are on the outside of the home before they enter the house, so it can be as simple as some pipe insulation. I've seen customers use towels just to wrap around the pipes just to keep the frost off them. And so this will mostly apply to sort of the outdoor piping, say like yeah. if they have irrigation and whatnot? Yeah, yeah, pretty much everything outside uh, before it enters the house would pro it would help just to take care of that. So yeah, just the basic um, insulation that you can buy at any hardware store, you, you can cut it, put it around your pipe, keep the frost off it, and that will help it from freezing. So we were talking a little bit earlier, you know, busted pipes from freezing here in the valley. Very uncommon, but it does happen. It's happened a couple of times over the last few years, mainly with the customers up in Cave Creek, Carefree, Fountain Hills, places like that. We always recommend if your pipe is frozen or you see a leak, turn off your main. Contact us. We'll be out the same day to get you back up and running. Nice. And so you have a pretty cheap method right here. One, oh, one option yep. you have behind your back to yep. sort of show right here. This is a way to help protect uh, yeah, sort yeah. of the connector where your hose goes. Yeah, so you just hook it over to your hose. You pull, pull this anchor tight towards the wall and it will stop uh, frost from landing on your hose bib and can keep it from not uh, freezing. And so I guess are you guys preparing for a potential busy day tomorrow? Uh, it, you just never know how it's going to be, but definitely with them customers in the higher altitudes, we expect to head out and uh, help them out. All right, thank you so much, James. As you mentioned, take care of your pipes, but there's other things you want to also keep in mind when you hear that potential freeze. First, another one being your plants. If you have any that can be picked up and taken indoors that are susceptible to the cold, you may want to do that or properly cover them if you're not able to move them. Also, your pets, pets. please, please, yeah. please do not leave your pets outside in the cold. That is not good for them, as well as our elderly neighbors. You want to check on them as well because uh, it's going to be pretty chilly tomorrow uh, morning, uh, Scott and Olivia. Oof. And you're pretty tough. No gloves and just a little <laughs> small jacket. Just a very lightweight <laughs> layer. And yeah. I don't need good. It's, it's, two, it's two jackets, oh, okay. actually. All so. right. <laughs> All right, Steven, thank Steven, you. Thank you.